Hey guys, welcome to uh, my first podcast. Starting right off with a filler word. Uh, filler words like uh, like, things like that. I wasn't very aware that I used filler words a lot. And there's something on the internet that made me be very aware that I use a lot of fillers, as, you know, most people do. You know, is of another filler phrase. So, that point being is... I wanted to start a podcast to better my charisma with one thing being not using many filler words in my talking. I think charisma, communicating, sharing ideas, telling stories is extremely important in every aspect of human life. We are a species of communication, uh, social, we're very social creatures, and I think the better you're able to communicate and the more efficient you can better communicate just better all around of a communicator you'll be it's just best for you to be a better communicator <laughs> kind of went in a circle there i have much room to improve on talking so that was my original reason to start a podcast then i started thinking of different reasons of why to do a podcast and i guess i can start my first podcast by saying why I'm doing this, some of my goals, and discuss the process of some podcasts I'm going to start doing in the near future. So welcome to my first podcast. Thank you for tuning in. I hope to be able to organically emphasize to people that listening to podcasts is extremely helpful in everyday life because you can have this playing in the background like say music you can have music playing in the background music is a very powerful thing for kind of stimulating emotions in different ways and i think podcasting is a very powerful way of having your brain in a train of thought of thinking creatively and it's it's a form of just you know just simply listening to people and their ideas and their creativity and you can kind of dissect them and apply them in your lives and that's what i kind of do with a lot of podcasts i listen to um seth rogan tim ferris is the two main people i do listen to and i listen to a lot of podcasts when i'm at work doing muscle memory bullshit another thing too i'm gonna have cussing on this um i want to be as transparent as possible so i don't really have necessarily a format, a very structured format on these podcasts. I hope to be able to bring on many guests on here and have just great talks with them. Um, So I have some notes I've jot down. I'm going to be able to, I'm going to have little jot notes um, pulled up my computer on these podcasts, whether it be proposed questions, ideas, depending on the individual that I do have on these podcasts, I will... Prior to the podcast, I'll probably have a lot of jot notes, depending on the person. But for this podcast, I, of course, I'm going to be I'm by myself. Um, I'm downstairs. I'm in my in my room, in my area, by myself. Um, extremely tired, actually. Um, but I just want to get the train rolling. And I've been thinking about doing a podcast for the past 48 hours, and I just want to do one. <laughs> and so I, here we are. Okay, so... Podcast notes. Um, so I want to discuss. Um, this is more of an emphasized process. I am emphasizing the process of the podcasts that I am going to be doing. It's there's not too many objectives to doing these. Um, I don't have a, a very big goal of doing them. I just really want to do a podcast and I think it'd be very fun a very fun process but I do see a lot of benefits of doing them with charisma being one of them which is something I've already discussed so the whole goal goal of doing a pro- <laughs> cut that out the whole goal of doing a podcast is pretty much working on my charisma um, discussing stories and developing a little bit of transparency between some of the close people that are in my life and sharing ideas and proposing a lot of food for thought and just helping people that are are listening to these podcasts which by the way thank you to help you pretty much expand your thoughts um 
another jot note I have is guests. And I'm going to be having a lot of close people on my podcasts, and I'll be intending to kind of dissect them a little bit um, and have a little bit of a deeper insight on them as people, which will be fun, which will be fun. And hopefully I can conjure up some learning points that they could bring out from some of their you know past life experiences, their talents, the things they're interested in, just kind of collecting the dots and, you know, learning points of each individual that I do have on here. <clears throat> My next jot note on here is connecting the dots. As in many things in life, um, from learning things, doing things, meeting people, just the more diverse you are in things, the more new things you try, the more you kind of break out of the routine that society kind of proposes on people. The more things you do, the more things I notice, the more dots you kind of gather. And I think a lot of great minds are able to kind of see that. A lot of, a lot of great minds are able to collect these dots of life experiences, lessons, skills, and they're able to apply them in a vast amount of different things that are in life. And I hope in this podcast I'll be able to gather many thoughts from individuals and apply them to my life. And for listeners too, you can apply them to your lives. Next next point on here is, next jot note on here is the construction of thoughts. So I think that I personally... This is kind of a self-aware kind of thing. I've had trouble being transparent. I don't have a very thin line between my thoughts and structured thoughts in my brain. I don't have a very thin line between being able to express that vocally and express it through talking to people. And I hope in these podcasts I'll be able to construct thoughts better in a way that I can convey them to people in the in the simplest way possible. And I think that, you know, being transparent, sharing ideas, talking, just having, like, a connection with, like, the people you're talking to will be able to help me be more transparent between the thoughts that are, you know, in my skull and the things that I can say. And I hopefully can be able to develop the skill of, I guess this is charisma, charisma, second wave, kind of talking about charisma. So... That's pretty much the main points I want to talk about, and pretty much the some of the uh, reasons why I'm starting this podcast. Like I said, it's not there's not many objectives, just kind of the process of doing it. I'm extremely excited about. I'm extremely excited to do this. I think talking and communicating is a very powerful thing that humans have, and like I said earlier, we're, we're very social creatures. And I think doing a podcast is a great way of doing it, especially with the technology we have. We're able to just tune into people's lives through doing this. And it offers a very in-depth way of digging into, you know, the individuals who have on here and my thoughts, too. So I guess I can end it off here. It's pretty much why I'm doing a podcast extremely excited. I don't know how how much more I can emphasize that. I'm going to go to bed, um, meditate a little bit, wake up early in the morning, um, and figure where to upload this. I don't even have a platform, Harley. I think I'm going to upload these to YouTube. So thank you guys for tuning in, and have a great day, night, evening, whether whatever it be. Thank you.